My yes is yes. My no is no. My maybe is no. And I can change my mind at any time. I would like um, for you not to touch me right now. I would like, um, I'd like a hug. I would like for you to kind of give me a little extra space. Um, I'm not really feeling up to conversation. All of those things and thousands, millions of more can come up for people. Um, boundaries, consent, touch. So I have clients that have had amazing breakthroughs around with touch and they've been able to find touch in new ways and not only touch, see this is the thing that a lot of people don't understand. Um, touch isn't just about touch, it's about feeling safe and trust and consent. So you get to decide what happens to your body, right? We get to decide what our skin experiences, we get to decide what, how we experience, I mean, all of this, right? So if I'm not comfortable, I'm gonna tell you no. Hopefully, <laughs> like hopefully in that moment, I have the courage to say no. You know how hard it is to say no? It's super hard, but yet it's essential that for your sake I say no and for my sake I say no. So I have a client who just posted a video and she called it uh, treading water, treading touch. And, and it's really treading friendships, treading relationships. Why is that? Because once you, when you begin to learn that you have agency, which is capacity to advocate for yourself, you have capacity to say no and to say yes and, and to communicate your needs to your community, what does that do to the community? People freak out. Yeah, that, and it happens often. And, and I'd love for those of you who are in this work, um, who have done this work, and I'm not talking just practitioners, I'm talking anyone, that you've started to learn like, hey, I can say no right now, and I can say yes. What have you experienced with the people that you love, your community, your family, your friends? Did it take a while for them to shift and to be like, oh, she's serious, or oh, he, he, he really means it? So it takes time, right, for the community kind of, to see, and then they may question like, well, you're, you're not the same. I don't know if I like this. And it really is, it has nothing to do with them. It has to do with you and your growth. And realizing that if you've been saying yes your whole entire life, and you've been wanting to say no, it's time to say no. It's, it's I mean, to get to that point when you realize I need to say no, that's huge. Like right there, acknowledging that, and then to start doing it, um, it's equally difficult, especially for the community. So yeah, it's gonna make other people uncomfortable and they may not understand because they've gotten used to relating with you in one particular way and it's been convenient for them, right? Because they know they know the, the relationship rules, but when those relationship rules change, then what? Um, then new friendships get to develop, be developed. Um, it's you're recreating the friendship. You get to tell your friends, so look, I wanna start over. Can I press the reset button? Beep. You know, and I want to tell you more about myself, things I've discovered about myself. It may be really difficult, but I, I still want this relationship. I still want us. So um, I'd like to try some things out. I'm not sure how it's going to go. And I'd love for your, your patience in this and, um, and see what they say. And if it's, you know, if they, don't, they can't take your no, if a friend can't hear your no and, and, and respect your no, I know what I need to say next, but it's really hard, and I know it's so hard. If someone can't respect your no, they're not safe. I love telling people, and I love this phrase that I heard, you can't trust my yes if you don't know my no. I'm gonna say that again. You can't trust when I say yes to you until you've actually heard a no from me. Once you know I can say no to you, guess what? When I say yes, it's real. I'm a true yes, because you know I'm not afraid to say no. And yet it's really hard to hear no, and it's really hard to say no. Both sides feel rejection, both sides feel loss. There's confusion. So as you, either in your personal life, start growing into this and trying it out, or if you come and see someone like myself, who you get to practice these skills of yes and no in our sessions, and learn more about yourself, um, 
when you take it out to the world, I don't even know what my point was. Like, it might be difficult, right? It, it's like starting over again. And I, and I plead with you, don't give up. Because you matter. You being safe in the world matters as best as you can. I mean, there's enough um, like threat, right? We have enough threat in our, in our like world, like, you know, shooters and violence and all those things that we watch in the media. There's enough of that. We don't need threat and panic to happen with our closest friends in our community. We need to feel safe. We need to have trusting relationships. We can say yes and no, and they can say yes and no to us too. And, uh, and yeah, and good communication. If you find that you don't have that in your life, um, it's time to see a therapist potentially, like to get down to like, how can you start doing this? And if you feel like, man, I, know, I don't wanna talk about it. I mean, I'm done with therapy. Come to see a touch practitioner, a cuddle practitioner, or someone who's certified, who, who under, understands consent. Go to cuddle party. I mean, there's so much great about cuddle party where you can learn these skills. Um, there's, yeah, keep, keep exposing yourself to your yes and to your no. Even if you don't say it, feel it. Like go, am I yes or no to this? And, and then I think that's even, that's pretty easy sometimes. It's the maybe. This, this is part of cuddle party that I love. If you were a maybe to a request or even to a man or whatever, it's no. And what that means is when you say no to something, you're creating space for something else. And you can ask yourself, well then what am I a yes to? Right, because a no is just a yes in waiting. That's it. All right, I love you all. Mm.